Hi guys, I'm on here to share information about hand sanitizers, about immunity in the change of season. So first off, just to talk about bacteria, viruses, um, fungus, all the critters that make up this world. We are filled with and covered with all these bugs. That's what being human is. And it's crazy because there's actually more bugs um, on us than there are human cells amazing so keep in mind that you know to be afraid of bacteria and viruses silly in some ways because we need them to survive right a healthy balance of course and, and of course there are some that are not healthy um, so what we see now is the synthetic hand sanitizer getting really popular lately um, and I think it's good to keep in mind that really one of the the areas of concern in modern life is that we are inundated with synthetic chemicals and toxins. Um, there's something like 85,000 new chemicals that have been introduced in um, kind of my age group's lifetime and less than 10% have been tested. And even the ones that are tested, they kind of say, well, if you get like, you know, like less than 10% actually gets into your bloodstream and that's okay, but it really is about the accumulation of chemicals we're exposed to, especially as women. Um, and I don't know about you, but you know they might say that only a certain amount of aluminum from deodorant is getting into my bloodstream. Um, but with breast cancer on the rise, there's no way I'm going to use traditional deodorant. <laughs> you know, I haven't for like 15 years. So it's really up to us to look after ourselves, not to trust any sort of government or um, any other large health organization. It's up to us. And so with that in mind, knowing that like a lot of stuff we're exposed to is toxic. Hand sanitizers are one of those things. So if you're seeing like a conventional synthetic hand sanitizer you'd see at the airport, a public place, your doctor's office, um, just look at the ingredients and look up those ingredients so you actually know what you're putting on your body. So from my perspective, I fortify my system with essential oils. And one comparison I want to share with you is that Hand sanitizers only kill bacteria, right? Synthetic medication can only attack bacteria, antibiotics, for example. They cannot, they cannot affect viruses, and that's because a virus is located within a cell, right? Essential oils penetrate cell walls. This is why they work, and this is why in many cases they're more effective than synthetic medication. There's a time and a place for that, of course, for modern medicine when you need it, but there's also a time and place to use natural solutions and in my opinion always go to them first. So if an essential oil can penetrate a cell wall and affect a virus and a medication can't plus my body has to deal with the effects of the medication so if I'm sick my body has to heal from the sickness plus the medication why would I do that to myself? So one of the best blends I like to use during seasonal changes or if I'm traveling or I'm going to be around lots of people um, or I'm just feeling a bit run down is On Guard Blend by doTERRA. And I only uh, recommend doTERRA for a number of reasons. So On Guard is wild orange, cloves, cinnamon, eucalyptus, rosemary. Um, and this is an immune system blend. So this will fortify your immune system. So I always use it preventatively just to keep my body really strong should I come in contact with something. And of course, when I travel. And um, like when I went back to America like, like about a month ago, I um, was ingesting it. I was putting it on my body with a carrier oil and they conveniently make a sanitizing mist. So instead of that scary hand sanitizer that doesn't even get viruses anyway, so why is everybody buying them right now when they're scared of coronavirus? <laughs> um, I use this because this actually can have an effect um, on the inside of my cells. So, um, it's just convenient in this bottle. And so you've got um, a safe sanitizer that you can, you know, if you can't wash your hands and you can put this on or put it on the surfaces around you. So that is my recommendation. Um, if you have any questions about essential oils for natural health or using doTERRA specifically, they're the only oils that I feel um, that I can trust with my health. Um, of course, I'm happy to, to talk with you about it. Stay healthy and take care of your immune system.